Anthony, oh. hi. I was hoping I'd catch you. Hi, Barbara. Looks like they slipped some of your mail in with mine again. That's so weird. That keeps happening. U.S. Postal Service, am I right? You know, you really can't just slip it under the door next time. You know, now that I got you here, I wanted to ask you, are you okay? Yeah. It sounded like you were fighting with your wife a little uh, bit. Not my wife. Sorry, your fiance. She's, she's my girlfriend. Oh, when are you going to propose already? <laughs> <laughs> not getting any younger, you yeah. know? Uh, I'm sorry if we were loud. No, be louder, please. I mean, I wasn't eavesdropping or anything. You know, it's just when it gets too warm outside, I like to open my window. It's and, February. And you're right there next to it. So sometimes the sound travels at the speed of light or whatever, you know? So, yeah. so I hear some things. I really got I heard it. you mention something about eating at Pagliacci's. Were you there on Friday night by any chance? We were at Pagliacci's, yeah. Oh, you were? I'm late, Barbara. I gotta go. Well, listen, don't be a stranger. Okay. It's like I only see you when I have your mail. I feel like I see you very often. <laughs> I'm gonna take the mail. Oh, here you go. <laughs> Thank you very much for getting it. I really appreciate oh, it. Oh, don't forget to pay that credit card bill. Your payment's due in six days. You don't want to get a late fee. Good, good idea. Thank you, Barbara. Thank yeah, you, you very much. you want to make sure you keep your credit card. I'm late. I'm late for a very important date. All right. Bye-bye. Bye, Tom. Bye-bye. I got to call Carol.